launched the Art Offer Education Initiative in the U.S. and then Germany and Brazil. And with this most recent investment in South Africa, we're on track to reach over 1.2 million learners, 10,000 teachers, and over 2,500 schools across our communities globally. Most programs running in South Africa from a CSI perspective are between three and five years. So it is not common for us to have a 10-year program. Specifically with the program here in South Africa, we'll invest broadly in schools across our communities. It'll allow for opportunities for our employees to engage with these schools. It'll help us attract a diverse STEM talent pipeline as we go into the next 10 years and beyond. And it'll create opportunities for RDA to enhance our brand locally. But I think most importantly, it'll give our employees a chance to give back into our local communities where our people are. The project has brought about such change. Each grade, each subject has different facilitators. They don't just come in like other people coming to observe us or anything of that sort, but they come to support. So now learners enjoy that. Once a new person comes in, it brings out that excitement because they want to learn other things. And I think that has benefited them into enjoying our maths and science. I feel like they've made learning fun because they don't only focus on the theory part, but they also do practicals. And having to learn in a friendly environment, I feel like that also helps in sort of improving your marks because the friendlier the teacher, the more you understand the subject and the easier it is for you to go to that certain teacher and ask where you don't understand and they can assist you without hesitation. We know that there is a lack of teaching for mathematics, for sciences. We close that particular gap. Learners that we are supporting in pure mathematics will say we have achieved our goals if they choose pure mathematics in the FET. FET is Further Education and Training Band, that is grade 10, 11 and 12. So we don't want to see any of our learners dropping to do mathematical literacy because you will not be able to follow engineering STEM careers with mathematical literacy. I was struggling with science a lot because I was thinking the subject is actually difficult. But when the program came this year, I started being helpful because our project representative made things look easier. He made examples more practical. So more examples being practical means more understanding for us. When you teach maths properly and effectively, people reason out. Every statement that which comes across in mathematics is reasoned out. And as such, it learns properly. And that concept is able to be developed further, unlike a concept which was just memorized. A grade 10 learner is more confident enough to teach both grade 10s and grade 11s. Now, do you see the confidence which happens from the side of the learners when they get the extra tutelage from the other people? ADA has brought with this program that understanding, you know, from teachers to learners. It is so easy for learners to work with experiments. Learners are able to work independently on their own without teachers now. They are able to maneuver through whatever experiments that is there, especially in physical science and mathematics. Art of education is really important to uplift young people and the young generation in, within our communities, and to empower them with the right resources, to give them an opportunity to you know, obviously make a change in their own lives and obviously to better our communities going forward. This is also really important to order because of how we invest in our communities and sport does play a big role in South Africa, but education has to be plan A. Hopefully through this project, we can inspire the next president or Springbok rugby player.